What's going on YouTube? Ground Chuck here in the Ground Chuck game room. Um, it's Wednesday, October 12th, and I'm going to go over, uh, it's a new pickup for me, and which I got a while ago, but it's now evolved into a new player PC. So, hashtag big clue. If you guys don't know who that is, that's Ted Kluzewski. So, I'm trying to get my reflection out of there. Uh, Ted Kluzewski. I absolutely love this card since I laid eyes on it as a kid. I was able to pick this up at a decent price. Yeah, it's off center, left to right, right to left, however you want to say it. Uh, but it's really sharp. I just absolutely love the uh, this card because just the sheer image itself, him being just a, more or less a badass, being sleeveless in those god awful warm wool uniforms. So I mean, the, the uniforms themselves are just insane. They're they're awesome. But how hot they were to wear those in this in you know during the summers, but. If you look close to right under his left arm, I, that that uniform with Mister the Cincinnati Red Leg on there, and it, it's just his his look of intensity on his fall through on his swing, sleeveless, big dude. Uh, I just I was so glad to add this to my uh, collection a while ago, and this is probably about six eight months ago. And then I started thinking about it. I'm like, wow, that's pretty... I just love that card. I can't stop looking at it when I uh, go through my vintage stuff. And, and you know, he wasn't a small fella. I mean, he was 6'2", about two, 225, 230. But I'm going to bring this a little closer. But uh, he actually had a really decent career. I mean, he played 15 years. Um, I can't stop looking at it. Uh, he amassed over 1,700 hits, had 279 home runs, over 1,000 RBIs. Uh, but there was a period in that. I mean, he played for the Cincinnati Red Legs, the Pittsburgh Pirates, the Chicago White Sox, and I think one ended his career in L.A. with the Angels. And so I just I started thinking about and, and looking into, you know, what he did, I mean, as far as in the game and statistic wise and stuff. And I mean, it wasn't crazy, crazy, but I mean, he was a four time all-star. I mean, and six times he was top 18 in the, in the MVP voting. Three of those times he was top seven. One time he took second, you know, in 1954, he had 49 dingers and 141 RBIs. So in, in that period of time from 53 to 56, he was just a tear for the Reds. And that was, that was four of his, uh, the all-stars appearances but uh he was he had homers of 40 49 47 35 rbis 108 141 113 and 102 and i mean and then he kind of really fell off he had one other good year with the reds really good year with, with 25 and 111 but that was before his big outbreak outburst in the in the mid 50s but um uh, so yeah, new player PC for me. This was my first Klazuski card that I know of, uh, but it's not gonna be the last. I started looking at some stuff and and I have received some things, but I'm gonna start a new little Klazuski PC and do just show a card at a time when I pick something up or, and one of the reasons is, is obviously this is, to me is just a, incredible beautiful photograph uh of of a decent player and i'm not collecting him because he was the best or anything like that i'm collecting him just because i i like this it I like, like the look of his intensity that the style of this card and kind of what he brought to the table for a sh short period of time but it's just pretty cool i mean obviously he ha he had some cards he played from 47 to 61. So he has some, so he, has, he has some older vintage stuff. I love vintage. And when I was digging through his, uh, his um, trading card database, his player run of cards, I'm like, that's from a sweet set. That's from a sweet set. That's from a sweet set. So that's kind of why I'm going down this route. And I mean, he's not 
too expensive, but there's gonna be some that might be, but I'm just gonna have fun with it and have fun and run and just start picking up some big clues when I can. I've, I've gotten a stack over here to my left that I have received recently, but I just think it's gonna be a fun, fun little deal. It's something I've wanted to put together for a while based off of getting this card. So let me know what you think down below. Comment, like, subscribe, do whatever you want. It doesn't matter to me. But uh, if you do comment, let me know, is there like a PC, player PC that isn't somebody in, in everybody's, uh, on everybody's radar, if you will, you know? I mean, Andre Dawson, he's my main one, but he's not on everybody's radar, but like Big Clue, I mean, is, are there guys out there for your team or he's not even for my team, but I mean, just that you, you, you are gravitated towards picking up and collecting. So big clues mine right now. And I, I can't wait to add more. And like I said, I have and show them off to you guys and let me know what you think about this simply badass card. Um, Grown Chuck is going to be out under six and a half. Everybody stay safe. And thanks for watching.